Alright, alright. Let's get right into it, guys. Alright, alright, alright. Welcome to another stream, guys. You guys can see I'm studying some stuff. Trying to study. Uh, I've been studying all morning. I usually, that's usually my schedule. I usually wake up in the morning, and then I study, and then I go to the gym. And then from there, I end up, uh, yeah, I guess from there, my day kind of ends. Uh, yeah, but I kind of wanted to do this little stream today. I wanted to review some Instagram accounts. So um, generally, I, you guys already know that I'm on this, this thing, I guess, with everyone else. And I noticed that a lot of you guys are also fellow content creators. So... I thought, you know, why don't I review some, not just review, but like, let's look at some accounts and let's see um, if there's any improvements that we should make or uh, yeah, because I think we're all on this journey together. And yeah, one of the things that's good to have is sometimes a good perspective, a different point of view. Um, so I'm just going to look at some profiles you guys can already see as we are here. So I'm going to just go straight to there. Whoop, that is the wrong one, of course. Whoops. I was not meant to show that, but let's let's get back to that and let's uh let me figure this out. That's awkward. Uh let me see what's wrong here. Uh let's see now. Be back shortly. I am messing up. <laughs> you guys are looking at the journey. Okay, cool. So this is what this is what it is here. Um, let me just add my camera into there if I can. Okay, so we got my camera here. So maybe I'll change the title actually. Or maybe I'll just write as um, uh, checking out and reviewing Instagram accounts while studying. Okay. So I'm going to change the title here. Okay. So uh, I haven't been on Instagram in a while. Uh, as some of you guys already know, I was on a social media detox. If you guys don't know about that, uh, I have a video on that on my YouTube channel. You guys can check that out. But I was out for a while. So I, I'm just drinking some water. I put some, some lemons in here. So um, yeah, so... I was, on, I was out from Instagram for a while. Uh, reason why is, you know, sometimes I like to be away from Instagram. I don't like to always be on it. I would prefer to um, mainly just, you know, just focus on me. And I think I'm going to go on a detox for another month again. I'm going to 
I'm gonna what I'm gonna do is I am going to um I'm gonna get off it again. I'm just gonna review some accounts. If I need to DM people, I need to reach out to people. I'm gonna, you know, do what I have to do there. But uh, yeah, this is my account here. Uh, I will kind of go through the beginning of the the beginning stages of and things like that. I'm butchering my words here. But yeah, I'll go through the beginning stages of my account so you guys can kind of see. So for those of you who don't know, I did have a photography account which had a couple thousand followers. Uh, I ended up completely deleting that account simply because like I just didn't feel like it resonated with me. I wasn't showing the real me. I wasn't being authentic in that account. So I decided to make a new account called Ibra's Visions, right? And this account, it's been growing kind of slowly. It hasn't been growing the fastest. Um, but at the same time too, the algorithms changed and also I haven't been as active as I should be. So this was my first post, the Van City Blogger. That's what I was doing and I, I just reading through it. Let's try this again. My name is Ibrahima and I'm pleased to announce this new account. I hope that you find value in it and as I showcase my personal journey, journey through life, I'm still trying to figure out my Insta handle, but slowly but surely. So yeah, you guys can already see I did already have, see I even wrote it, update, no longer the Van City Blogger, but I have the name. DM if you want it. So if you want the name, send me a DM. You know, I I, I, I really don't need the name, but you know, I, I kind of just wanted to keep the name so that it doesn't just go to a random person who will just like have the name for for nothing. So Because even my own personal name is, my own personal name is on there, but somebody took my name. Like you guys, I'm going to show you guys right now. Somebody took my name, right? I'll show you guys right here. So... Ibrahima Sise. Uh, oh, maybe not actually. Oh yeah, here. I don't know who this is. I even emailed the, I even sent the person a DM. Uh, I don't know, maybe they don't speak English, but that they took the name. So I was like, you know what? I will have to figure out a different name. So that's why I have this name here, Ibra's Visions. So this is my account here. You guys can kind of see, I was trying to go more through the blogging. Um, the blogging life and stuff like that but i realized you know maybe i'll add some photography uh now my profile is definitely not perfect it is by no means perfect at all like it is i mean the the number of followers reflects the not it doesn't necessarily reflect how i'm doing but at the same time too like it could be done way better like it could be way way better so this is my account uh you guys can see i went traveling i I did that and then that was kind of like my photography thing. This is a really good photo too. Uh, had a lot of likes. I did promote this post. So that's part of the reason why I did have a lot of likes compared to like these 38, 36. Now when I had my other Instagram account, I used to have like, like 200 followers consistent. Uh, sorry, two, 200 likes consistently. I used to have like a lot of likes, just consistent likes all the time. Right. But ever since, I made this account, it's been a little bit different. You know, it hasn't been, I don't know if it's hitting the algorithm the way that I I used to hit the algorithm. But at the same time too, I was posting like three times a day. So we have this post too, which was like, I guess my, uh, I was kind of like vlogging here when I was in Spain. Um, you guys can kind of see that I was vlogging while I was in Spain. So yeah, I was kind of vlogging the, the stuff in Spain while I was there. So yeah, you guys can see I'm actually in the camp new as well. Uh, but yeah, anyways, I'm wasting time. So the thing I wanted to talk about, okay, so if I could do something different in my account, what would it be? So in my personal account right now, what is going on is I'm kind of rebranding. I'm kind of making it, you guys can see my last couple of posts have been me. Um, so ideally I would like for my posts to be more like that. Uh, I don't really want to throw in too much photography in there simply because I just feel like photography is, is an art form, which I will add like every now and then, but I would prefer to keep it more as a personal account. Right? So that is something I'm trying to figure out. I'm almost at 400 followers. I probably would have been at around 400 followers had I uploaded this month or done, uh, I didn't go out of detox this month, but you know what? It's, it is what it is. I don't really, I'm not really looking to have the most followers. I'm just looking to, uh, 
just utilize this and use it as a tool. And now I kind of know what I did before, what I did wrong. If I have a picture of that account, I will show you guys. I don't know if I can ever find it. I, I completely deleted it. So I don't think I can ever show you guys, but that's kind of the account. And then also here, what I hit books. Okay, so how I'm crushing it. It was the Titans, Tim Ferriss. Uh, okay, cool. That was like, I kind of made like a book section. So for me, the, what I'm going to do, start doing is I'm going to start doing photo shoots with certain individuals um, and I'm going to start posting more pictures, right? Uh, but I don't want it to just be like pictures, pictures, pictures and no, no meaning behind it or anything meaningful, nothing meaningful behind it. I would like it to be like provide some sort of value, whether I don't know how it would provide some value, but I would like for it to provide some value. Uh, so that's part of the reason why uh, with this account, it is like that. So I'm going to go through some accounts that I do like. Uh, this is a good account here. Uh, Alex Costa. So Alex Costa is probably like what I'm aiming for in terms of like my, my brand. I would like to do something like this. Like this is ideally what I would like to do. Um, I guess I would like to be the black Alex Costa. If that makes sense. That, that's kind of like what I'm, what I would like to do. Ideally he is in his thirties. I think he's like 31 or 32. So, uh, and he did start a little like, uh, I think 2016 or 17. So He's been, he hasn't, is, so he, he was still, so I'm 25, so I, I kind of look at it, okay, you know what, it's not that I have time, but I'm, you know, I'm still in the process of figuring all this stuff out. So this is ideally what the profile I would like to have, uh, something kind of like this. Uh, I would like to add some photography, of course, because that is part of what started me with everything, but I ideally, this is something that I would like to have my account is more catered and i feel like this is what i'm my brand i want it to be more catered around lifestyle fitness fashion more lifestyle so that's kind of what i want for my own personal profile so that's why i do look at guys like alex costa as like a uh, inspiration uh another account i don't follow him i don't believe but maybe i do Teaching men's fashion. So teaching men's fashion is another guy. I don't really like, I'm not a huge follower of him, but I do like, I like the way he's established his brand, right? Um, I'm not really into like shirtless pics and stuff like that. That's not really me. Uh, even when I start making fitness, like fitness stuff, I don't want to like just post that kind of stuff, just like shirtless pictures of me. But I do like this. It's very nice. The aesthetics is, 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 is it's a good aesthetics. Uh, something like this, you know, incorporate fitness along with it. He has his own brand, Essentials. So he's doing his thing. I like even this. This is a good picture. I like the jacket. Uh, I was going to buy one of these jackets, but uh, I just didn't end up doing it. I will probably do it maybe next winter. So yeah, or maybe even this winter. We'll see. So for me, I wouldn't, I'm not going to probably post pictures of like, of uh you know my family and stuff like that maybe if someone wants to be incorporated of course but if they don't want to i don't i'm not gonna force anyone to uh this is him and alex costa uh how to beast another guy i like to watch uh pretty consistently on youtube uh who else is there there's also whoops so there's alex costa how to beast uh i think this is get oh, love love serve i think i don't really yeah, not, not too sure uh i don't know these guys this guy used to work for brandon carter i know that uh and then these guys i don't know them i think that's his team uh centrals yeah so essentially no pun intended uh i'd like to grow out i like to grow like some sort of brands so kind of like that uh this is kind of cool too i, I kind of like that i kind of like that a lot actually so so yeah this is this guy has a really cool profile um, I think this is really, really cool as well. So that's something that I would probably like to, um, uh, kind of emulate. And then there, there's also how to beast. Now how to beast is a little more catered towards fitness. Um, his pictures are a little more like, I, I wouldn't want these, these kind of pictures, to be honest. Like, that's not really what I'm looking for. I'm not looking, I, I although I do follow him on YouTube. I'm not really looking for like shirtless pictures and stuff like that. That's just not really me. 
Um, and if that's you, by all means, like, I, I mean, if that's what you do, then it is what it is. Um, but for me, that's not really what I'm, what I'm looking for, but I do like his brand on YouTube. I do like what he does. Uh, I do, I do really like that. And I see, I want to see if essentials has a thing here. Okay, cool. So they do. Let's, I want to see what they have here. Okay. So they have, I like this. I actually really like this. Uh, it's very nice. Very, it's very like, I like his clothing cause it's clothing. Like it's, it's very like casual. Um, some of the clothing sometimes is a little too exaggerated in my opinion. Like this is nice. It's like, it's very simple. Like I, I like simple clothing. That's, that's the kind of clothing that I like. So if I could do anything, I guess it would be similar to something like this. Uh, but yeah, this is, this is really cool. Uh, I've seen this guy somewhere. I've seen these pictures before. Let's just, I just want to see his profile. I don't know who he is, but I've seen him his profile before. Okay. So, okay. So his name is Blake Scott. He's verified 641K. Um, okay. So this guy, he dresses nice. Uh, yeah, ideally I'd like to do something like, like this. Uh, I just like this post, whatever. Just give him the like. Um, sometimes I don't like post because I am on a detox. So this is my, like literally I, I opened my IG, I think like yesterday or was it this morning? It could have been this morning. Yeah, it was this morning. I opened my IG this morning and I was like, you know what? I'm not going to check anything. I'm just going to relax. Uh, and then I was like, you know what? You're, you're checking out profiles. Why don't you just make a, a stream or a video behind it? Okay. So, so what I was actually checking out is, uh, so this is, this is someone that I know, uh, I think it's cream clothing. Is this the one? I think this is the one. No. Hamdi. Name's Hamdi. Okay, cool. So this is cream clothing. Uh, this is his clothing thing. Uh, I like, I like this one. This is cool. Um, yeah, these are very, very clean photos. That's the reason why I was kind of like just looking at profiles, just seeing how everybody's doing and stuff like that. So he's cool too. Uh, another photographer. He does, yeah, he does a lot of photography. Uh, you can see his photos are nice and clean, which is very good. So yeah, shout out to him. Shout out to Hamdi. You're probably not watching this, but shout out to you. Um, what's up, Football Edit? Any Instagram accounts you want me to review? Yeah, very clean profile. Um, yeah, not much to say. Uh, yeah, this is pretty. This is a pretty good profile. Uh, another guy I wanted to check out. I'm just like checking these guys out. Uh, App Cool, App Cool's cool too. Cool too. Uh, he does YouTube videos as well. Maybe I'll review some of his YouTube videos. He probably won't see this either but you know app cool is, is cool too um yeah so that's another guy uh he's cool too app cool you know he, he has a good character and he has good style so yeah uh would love your feedback on squishy official photography account but haven't posted in a while edits are a little over the top uh but want to tone them down in the future Okay, uh, let's see. I think you followed me. Maybe, maybe you did follow me recently. If you did, I'll follow you back. Oh, you did. Okay, so this is you, right? Okay, yeah, I'll follow back. Cool. So let's see. So street portrait, landscape, city, Toronto, Hamilton, personal, fishy official. Uh, okay. Okay, so that's nice. That's nice. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, so. Okay, football edits. Yeah, uh, send me your IG. I think I have it, right? Okay, so I actually like this, man. Like, it's... Uh, let's see when you upload it, though. May 13th. Okay, so May 13th. So, uh, okay, oh, wow. New York? Spain? Bro, you travel, eh? Miss shooting. Yeah, I mean, everything is good here. I, I would just say you just post more often. So you, okay, so you post, um, okay, cool. So you post a lot of, so you post portraits and then you post, uh, some cityscapes. This is nice. Whoa, this is a nice picture. Woo. I should like them. I'm sorry. I, 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 I've been away from IG that I just have not been, uh, I haven't been active on this. So it's, it's kind of like, okay. So that's a really nice picture, by the way. Um, very nice picture. 
Wow, this is really cool too. Let's see your first picture. How many posts have you had? 75, okay. Okay, so that's your first one. Welcome, first post. That's good. Play no games. Okay, okay. I love nighttime photography. Okay. Yeah, you notice. So you you like um so you like uh edits your level tab? I don't know. I wouldn't say they're a little over the top. Oh, this is nice. This is nice too, DeMar DeRozan. Shout out to him. I guess this is your friend, I think. If I'm, if I'm correct. Yeah, I would say I would say your your style is really good, man. I am um it is quite similar to okay, so I, I like your oh this one's nice too. This one's really clean. Uh this one is interesting too. Baltimore. Why? Wow, so you travel a lot. Okay, so street portrait landscape, uh, Canada, Mississauga, Hamilton. Uh, let's see, you have different accounts. So, so you have a YouTube account too on the come up. So I think this is your IG, right? If I'm right? No, this is your Twitter. Okay. So, uh, okay. So you have like a business that you're, uh, okay, it's your time. Uh, so you have a business that you are currently, okay. So that's cool. Okay. Website coming soon on the come up. Okay, so obviously you have the website is not built yet, which is fine. It's like every the thing about it is sometimes sometimes we tend to um we tend to oh, when people when people see something they're just like oh this person's not doing anything. But the reality is life comes in the way, and sometimes we can't do everything all at once. So the fact that you have this IG account here, it's amazing. I'm sorry, not IG. Twitter account is amazing because, and you're consistent. Like the last time was October 18th, you retweeted, so you retweet stuff. I'm, I'll, I'm gonna follow. Uh, you don't have to follow me back. You know why? Because I just look at a lot of, I, 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 I mix up a lot of like football and like stuff like that. So I, I don't expect people to follow me back on on Twitter, but, um, yeah. You, you're a creator, hey. I you don't have to follow me back. Don't don't even worry. I I, I don't I don't get mad when people follow me back. Um, so okay, that's very clean. Okay, so you have that, and then you have your Twitter account. So you're okay. So I like your your link tree is nice. Uh, it's very nice. It's very simple. Uh, okay, so let's watch this. It's how to start a YouTube channel? Throw away DSLR. I probably won't watch the whole video, of course, because I do have a class in like a couple hour like maybe like like i have to leave in like a few hours i have to get ready and stuff like that uh but let's just watch a little bit of it already did huh <laughs> appreciate it okay cool i appreciate it man okay let's see this hold on let's see get i just heard a little bit i don't think you guys heard all, all of it but let's just view it here DSLR to start your YouTube channel? Are you dumb? Get rid of the DSLR if you actually want to start a successful YouTube channel. Come on, guys. You guys should know better. The industry is tricking you. The camera industry is tricking you. I'm telling you, for real. Throw away that DSLR like that. I'll make sure that it sounds okay. Okay, cool. So we are good to go. So you live in Toronto, eh? This date has been September twenty first. Six years overdue. This is your first video? Yeah, six years overdue. So I guess I with YouTube, next post for schedules for yeah, Saturday. Um, I subscribe. Talking about why I finally decided to do oh, I like it. Uh some of y'all know I've been talking about YouTube since probably grade eight, I wanna say. End of grade eight. That would be 20... 20 2014. Damn. Oh, you have another video. Hold up, hold up, hold up here. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I have to play this. Uh, I, I have to play this because I, I don't know. You must be trolling here.
<laughs> nice, man. <laughs> okay, interesting. Well, fair enough. <laughs> I like that. I actually like that. I, I like that start. Okay, cool. Saga. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I live in uh in west uh, western Canada, Vancouver. Hey man, at the end of the day, like when it's your time to start, it's your time to start. Like, like we're all kind of on this journey together. There's like nothing. Like, you know, you know what I mean? Like, and your, your video is pretty quality. You record this with your phone? Like, this is nice. This is like, this is high quality, man. Yeah, so... What are we gonna talk about here? Yeah, we'll talk about uh, why I finally decided to do YouTube. So basically, here's the thing, right? Um, I don't want to call myself a perfectionist, but at the same time... Whenever I start a project, especially creative ones, I get really hung up on the details. So this is actually not my first YouTube video. I've filmed several vi videos before. Oh no, yeah, I, th I think everyone, we've all been through that. Uh, that struggle of starting videos. <laughs> well, not videos, but just anything in general. I think it's, uh, like, for me, I'm more of a, I'm, I have more of a business mind than an artist mindset. But even me... I uh, sometimes I'll have something and like I'll just be like oh man like I want it to be better <laughs> I straight up want it to be better and I, sometimes it's just like why is it why why is it not why is it not working out why is it not any better here like why and sometimes it's like I'm hesitant to even put it out there because especially on IG I'm definitely more con self-conscious on IG than YouTube YouTube I I, I do I, I should probably stop like just uh, I, like I, I, I don't care as much but on IG, for some reason, it's like anytime I'm about to post something, I used to be the opposite. And when I was the opposite, I did really well on IG, on the account that I deleted with a couple thousand followers. Because um, I just posted, like I posted like a lot and people just started coming in. But now it's like I'm so self-conscious. Um, so yeah, I can 100% relate with you on, on that point, 100%. But then I didn't like individual details and then... Yeah, I just always scrapped them. Wow, the Pixel 2. Um, so then I kind of realized, like, hey, you're capable of better, making better videos. And that was the kind of the thought going on in my head the entire time. Right? Like, you're capable of doing better videos. Scrap this one. Make a better one, right? Um, By the way, football edits. I will get to your IG account as well. Uh, I'm just going to finish this video, and then I'll get straight to your account as well, and then review it. And then what ended up happening is it just ended up procrastinating for six years, you know. Um, first, the excuse was, hey, I don't have a proper camera. I know how to use a proper camera, but I just don't have one. So then the goal was, okay, save up for a camera, get a camera. And then that also, well, that was good because it kind of kickstarted my whole photography thing. Uh, plug at Squishy Official if you aren't already following. Uh, hopefully I'll post soon. Um, but yeah, I had a DSLR, uh, DSLR camera. Now, I got the Rebel T6i. For those of you that are like pro videos, pro videographers or photographers, like, okay, it's not that great of a camera, I know. Ah! T6i is pretty good, man. T6i is, um, obviously, obviously, um, when you think about it obviously it's not going to be as good as like like a camera that can shoot 4k like with 30 frames per second or 60 frames but t6i is good i had an add for a while um i didn't really like the add because I, I don't know i just couldn't figure out the canon system i didn't really like the canon system personally and i use fuji now but the t6i is a good camera i think it's t7i now right t6i is a really really good camera i remember i had it when i was in photography school I used was it the T5i or T4i? It was one of the one. It was one of those, and it was great. Like just random. Like it all matters on the lens that you use. So I don't know what lens you use. Of course, you probably already know your stuff. So, like obviously, I like when I was using Nikon. I like a thirty-five millimeter lens. I'm probably gonna get a thirty-five mil on my Fuji. Uh, I have an XT3, so I'm probably gonna get the yeah. Probably gonna get the thirty-five mil because I just love. I love the way it looks. 
Uh, it has the le the focal length of a 50 millimeter lens because it is crop and I'm sure yours is cropped as well. Uh, and but one time I was with uh, with a friend, right? And he was uh, he was like a a photographer, right? And he kind he's kind of the reason why I started photography. So I saw we shot I shot with him, right? He shot with a 35 mil. I was like, wow, this is the cleanest types of photos I've ever shot on, right? And then I was like, dude, I should try that too. And yeah, so what happened was I ended up getting a 35 millimeter lens. I think it was like 200 bucks on Nikon. And people thought that like my camera, people literally came up to me, like other photographers. They were like, oh, I was like, oh yeah, I'm just my 31. I'm like, use a 3100? I thought I used like a D810 or something or a D750. I was like, no, no. And those are like, like I think it was like $1,000 at that time or maybe it's like 1500. Uh, I was like, no, I use a, I use a Nikon D3100, which was like, like 150 bucks and the lens was 200 so it's like 350 dollars setup so i mean the it takes size is a great camera uh as long as i mean even if like if it is a kit i don't like the kit lenses of those fuji's kit lenses are good but i don't really like the kit lenses of nikon or canon uh but if you have like a decent lens like whatever lens works for you i i 100 like the, those lenses Oh wow! So I'm I'm really just checking out. I, initially, I was like, oh, I'm just gonna like look at a little bit into the video, but it looks like I'm gonna be looking deep into this. So let's get it. Thing is, it was a solid camera, right? And I could have created a lot of content with it. I sat with it for like two, three years. I mean, I made a couple videos, but then I ended up scrapping them, right? So was it really worth it? I was thinking of making the. So okay, so I'm thinking of making uh uh the switch to fuji account uh fuji okay fuji yeah fuji's great um obviously when you go to that range you'll have to figure out what you want right like f the xt3 i bought mine for like 2200 i think and i think it was with the kit lens uh i got it on craigslist i think it was like 2000 so it's it's not a cheap investment right but would i say it's worth it i would 100 percent say it was it's it's worth it you know, I still use the kit lens. The kit lens of Fuji systems are amazing. The lenses are amazing. Uh, everything is all in one, so it's they're all crop frame. So it's meant they so they they kind of enhance. They make it so that it's the highest quality possible. Whereas if you get Nikon or a Canon or even a Sony, you're gonna have to spend a little more money on it, right? Uh, I can, I'll check on Craigslist right now. I, I don't know how much they cost now, but they costed a lot before. Uh, if you get a Sony, I think it's a Sony a7 Sony a7, I think they a7 III, right? So 2100, right? Which is not bad. It's a body, right? But you think about it. The lenses are gonna be the lenses for Sony are very very expensive Like I don't know what how to say this maybe uh, I think it's like 28 Was it 20 24 to 7? Let's just look for 24 to 70 see how much they cost so not the 2.8 i'm looking for the specific one yeah the g master lens see the g master lens here you see that this one here this one and this is just a person selling so obviously it could be more or less but you can see that this lens is expensive man like this is like this is expensive even the tamron i initially i was gonna go for sony the a7 III. i was gonna get the tamron and then i was gonna go travel with that but i didn't end up doing that so you can already see that like it's a thousand bucks, right? Like, how much is the XT3 now? The XT4 is out. So, if you're looking for something with a flip out screen, you can get an XT3 a thousand dollars, right? 2500 for there's not as many, but a thousand dollars. And this is this is in Vancouver, so obviously, where you're at Toronto, there's probably way more sellers because way more people there, and you could probably get it cheaper. And then let's go, like, uh, I don't know what lens, like, maybe, uh, let's go 35 millimeter lens i i, I don't know if it, maybe there is maybe there isn't 35 uh let's see are there any 35 millimeter lenses for fuji yeah i see 660 450 f f2 um yeah you, you can clearly see the difference in price 27 mil this, and this is a store so obviously if you find one like from a seller and these guys will probably give you a warranty because it's a store i i know this store uh, I've been there a few times. Twenty three mil. So you, you you look at this seventy to three uh three hundred mil. So obviously you 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 do want to check out obviously uh obviously your budget 
and things along those lines. But Sony, honestly, is is great. Like I I can't I can't tell you that Sony's not great. Sony is is, is Sony is great. Like if I had the money right now, I'd probably honestly I wouldn't switch personally. I would go if I had the money right now, I'd buy an XT4 and then get maybe a couple lenses. But I would get a Sony camera maybe to like shoot other things. I don't know. Sony is great. Like I, there's no there's nothing wrong with Sony at all. Like Sony is great. Uh, if you're getting into Sony, you're gonna have probably a better ecosystem since more things are catered towards Sony. Uh, you're it's just you know the lens qualities. I, I don't know if they're gonna be better, but you will have like the variety of lenses are are more versatile. Um, with Fuji, it's more like specific. So, but with I feel like with with Fuji, the great thing about Fuji is it takes amazing photos. Like it's just amazing. But anyways, I'm rambling. So uh, let's get back into this. But that's my thoughts. That's my two cents on all that stuff. So, um, oops, I keep hitting my mic. Kind of all over the place. Uh, yeah. So I got a camera, trying to seek perfection. I shot a few videos. Didn't like how they turned out. Didn't post it. But if I post it, I'll take it down real quick. Um, Took it down real quick. No. Realization. Yes, we can talk. Uh, excuse me. Yes, I can talk. Man, can't complete a full sentence. Um, yeah. Like, I'm never going to start YouTube if I'm trying to seek perfection, basically, right? So. This is true. I figured throw up that. Oh, that I reminded to take some water. Oh. <laughs> um, always hydrate, man. Yeah, what was I saying? Damn, I got distracted easily. Because I know that there's a full basketball game going on right over there. Um, but yeah. What was I saying? <laughs> yeah, I'm always chasing perfection with all Rain the fog. video thing. And then I realize it's never going to happen. So then I kind of get like. I've been fed up several times, and then I was like, all right, I'm going to make a video. Let's do it. Excuse me, I'm just trying to... All right. Yeah, so I was like, let's make a video. And I was like, all right, sure, let's make a video. Start filming a video, start obsessing over every detail, have a whole script planned out. This one's t totally off the cuff. I don't have a script planned out. All I knew was, okay, let's talk about why I finally started YouTube, you know? And, like, follow up that last video. Okay, my question to you now is what, what kind of videos are you looking to start? Uh... Like what? What are you uh, leaning towards? For me right now, in my channel, I'm looking to incorporate some lifestyle, uh, fitness. I guess I have a fitness channel for that, but uh, and I'm also looking to is it men's fashion. So I'm looking more into men's grooming, fashion, and lifestyle, but also like streams as well, where we kind of talk about like I don't know, like just random things like that. You know what I mean? So what, what are you looking to, like, ideally, what would you like your YouTube videos to be like? Would you, uh, from, I don't know you, uh, but obviously, I guess, first impressions, uh, you seem that you're really into photography, into gear, uh, you're into, like, creative, creative stuff. You're probably way more creative than I am. I'm not creative at all. Like, I'm more, I have a very, like, uh, how do I say it? I have a very, like, like i'm very like this and some people they can like that's why when i look at my videos i'm like no my videos are like <laughs> but like when i look at some other people i'm just like wow that person had that that guy that person's creative that person knows what they're doing uh yeah so uh, what, uh, what are you looking to do uh lifestyle tech photography podcast okay okay do you have any uh any channels that you're trying to emulate like do you have any channels that you look up to or do you have like any any channels that you look that you watch and you're like yes i want to create videos not like them but you know like i really look up to these videos like these are inspirational optimization that's good too lifestyle tech photography podcasts okay while we wait for the answer we'll keep watching the video um, yeah yeah so then everything just got delayed and delayed and delayed and then that day that i made that previous video i was just like yo like i'm never gonna do this because i'm always obsessed with the details so then i just filmed like the dumbest video possible right like i think i was like flipping my glasses and off a like glare or something and i said i'm on youtube right 
Because, like, at least put something out. Like, yeah. The conversation on 100%. Yourself, you know? Like, even if it's terrible, even if you're capable of a lot better, like, just put something out, you know? So Bro, yeah, honestly, like, that's the key. You just have to honestly start. Um, you have to start whenever you're doing it. Like, just you just have to start. That's literally the key. Like, there, the, like, a lot of times, like, we, we are chasing this perfection. We're trying to um, figure out what we want to do uh what we should do but sometimes you just have to like put it out there and as you make videos the more videos you make the better you're gonna get uh, i'm gonna pull up i'm gonna i'll pull up like one of my like oldest oldest videos uh i've been making videos for a while now so i i i i, I like but this is my first ever video uh but in the meantime we'll listen to this um and then I didn't follow that up for a month. But okay, here's the commitment I'm trying to make, right? Like, I'm trying to post at least once a month. Even if it's just like a super dumb video, just keep that consistency, you know? Once a month is amazing. You post post once a month, man. Like, honestly. Like, look at this. Look at this trash. I'm going to show you some trash right now. Oh, God. I don't even know why I'm showing this, but whatever. That's already, I, this, is, this is the first channel I ever made, right? Okay? The first channel I've ever made. And I am. This is trash, bro. Um, today I'm just gonna give you some life tips. And so All I right, started anyways. dancing because I was nervous and I didn't know what to say. I was just like, "Dude, how am I gonna do this? How am I gonna make this work? Like, how how do I do this?" Uh, I w this was like I think 2015, if I'm correct. What's up, guys? It's your boy Ebro. Um, today I'm just gonna give you some life tips and advice. So if you definitely want to take the advice, uh, anyways. So in today's topic, it's gonna be a little, it's gonna be a little straightforward, but it's a little, you know. So this is gonna be about waking up early in the morning and get more sleep. So uh, disclaimer: I'm not a morning person. I'm a night owl. So uh, every, <laughs> even though I try my best to wake up early, it's like I, I, I always get, I'm always kind of grumpy in the morning. So I always have to like drink some water, drink liquids. Um, but I do find that like my morning, I do find that mornings are more, I, I, I'm rambling, sorry, uh, so off topic. What I'm trying to say in this gym, like, okay, enough of this trash. Um, <laughs> all right. So, um, Cause otherwise I'll just be like, off the bat, man, your I videos are way better than mine. Like first video. impressions, at least I had this whole setup, starting off, get, like, the lighting uh, room, and then I wasn't going to film it in the did did minivan. Uh, I was going to film it like. What's up, football edits? On the green table, whole like mic setup. Maps is diverse. I have the gear, Thomas Frank. Like, the is, oh. Like, I over every single detail, and then it never gets done. Okay. You know? So. I'm okay. Uh, I don't know Michael Reeves or Louis Louis Rossman, but I do know Thomas Frank and Peter McKinnon. Uh, also looking to get better at short thing. Yeah, Peter McKinnon's great, man. Uh, <laughs> solid first video. Yeah. 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 Solid. Solid first video. <laughs> Yeah. Oh well. Um Yeah, thanks. <laughs> yeah, I mean storytelling is it, it's it's it, it happens, right? It, it it's it takes time to storytell. Like I remember I was watching a lot of videos on storytelling. I think it was like Peter McKinnon and uh how to storytell and stuff like that. Uh I'm doing good football edits. Um yeah, it takes it takes time though, man. Like honestly, your video right now is like it's pretty salt like it's pretty solid like there's a story behind it like you're you're kind of going through this this journey where you're talking about why like it took you so long to start a youtube channel and why you know you, you're still trying to figure this out which we're all in the same place which is why like you know like we're all we're all in that kind of similar stage where we're trying to figure out how to be the best versions of you know whatever we're doing so uh anyways i'm rambling i'm gonna post I, I apologize for keep stopping the video this and that like I, i'm gonna i'll just keep going i think every month hopefully i think the last post video i posted was august hope that's right it was july i'm sorry um but yeah so i'll post something even if it's like a five second clip of me just being dumb so be it um but i want to get something consistent going on with youtube at least i've been trying to do this for too long like i look 
Oh yeah, Chill Sonnen. He's great too. I, I've I I I'm not subscribed to him, but I've seen a lot of his videos as well. Um Yeah. Yeah, I can definitely review one of your videos for sure. I'll definitely review one of your videos. Uh my bad. It's, it's taking a little long for me to look at the, the video, but I guess it's like there's a lot to talk about within the video, which I think it provides a, a lot of great points. Uh just yeah, it, it, there's a lot of a lot of great points in, in this video. So I just kind of wanted to uh, kind of analyze it pretty deeply, but yeah, Chel Sonnen's he's Sonnen Sonnen. I, 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 he's he's pretty good. Man, like, I've been trying to do this since pranks were still relevant on YouTube. Just deep how far that, how long ago? Like Fussy Two pranks, Vitaly okay. pranks. Bro, I still remember like the whole prank wars day. Or what was the name of the guy? Uh, yeah, Fussy. There you go. <laughs> and then how crushed I was that I found out. What's the name? Roman Atwood. <laughs> fake, yeah, fake videos. And I went through that. Fake prank, sorry. And I was like, yo. Like, okay, originally when I wanted to start YouTube, I was like, yo, I'm gonna be like the next big prankster, right? Because that was what was going on at the time, right? And then I saw the whole prank thing die down. I found out they were all fake. Then I was like, well, then fun fact. Uh, I, again, I'm sorry for keep, I, the fact that keeps stopping, but uh, I looked up a lot to KSI, KSI Ola G B B T. Uh, and I really wanted to be a FIFA YouTuber. That was like what I wanted to do. Um, but as I started going a bit, th that was like the peak back in like 20, I think 2012. That was a peak, right? But I, our, that time I, I, when I was, with, I was with my parents there, it was like a small little apartment. So it was very hard to record videos or it was hard because we're all, I was, it was on the, all we had was a TV. I didn't have my own monitor. Oops. Sorry guys. I had my own console or anything like that. So, um, yeah, so that, that that's a, anyways, it's a, it's a random fact, but whatever. It was the age of the social experiments, you know? So I was like, all right, time to make some social experiments, you know? Like, I want to go out in the street and do something, right? So then I was like looking at these uh, lav mics, again, obsessing over every little detail and then never actually doing anything, right? So, and yeah, that just went on and on throughout the era of YouTube. And then for a while, I stopped watching YouTube. Now I'm back on it, um, but only mostly for sports stuff. Uh, like, I don't follow create like individual content creators as much anymore. Uh, I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Oh yeah, shout out uh, Zane Rao. Um, this guy. I met him three years ago. This man still had 400 subs. I don't know where he has now, where he's now, but I feel like he has like 30, 40,000 subs. Somewhere. What's his name? Uh, Zane, uh, okay, I'm gonna search him up. Transformation now, but I feel like he has like three, shout out uh, Zane Rao. Um, Zane Rao. Okay, I'm gonna search him up right now. Let me pull it up. Uh... Um, this guy. I met him three years ago. This man still had 400 subs. I don't know where he has now, where he's now, but I feel like he has like 30, 40,000, something like that. And like to see the transformation he went through, and just realizing like how much hard work he put in. Yo, Zane, if you're watching this, like, oh wow, respect, man. I know I. So this is Zane Rao here. And like, I think a year ago when I said I was thinking about making a YouTube channel, still haven't made anything yet. Uh, but yeah, anyways, that was impressive. Like, I met this guy when he was 400 subs. Wow, okay. And then I just saw him put in the work consistently day by day. Like, you see, he was posting on his story. He was posting on YouTube. He was gaining traction, right? He was hustling. And then He's I definitely like, hustling. I mean, I mean, even look at his first, like, his first video. I, I just want to see this. This is just a vlog. Yeah, it's. Oh wow! My guy hasn't. My guy hasn't even hit puberty yet. Holy! My guy has not hit puberty in this video. Oh my god! Oh my god! Here. That's a nice video. Uh, which one should I react to though? I kind of want to see him like just like, something like that. Give you guys some tips and tricks. Whoa. <laughs> okay. So he has grown up. I am a filmmaker and my name is Zane. If you like this video and the other videos you see on this channel, you want to have a user. Oh, okay. Contact you. They want to see that contact information. Yeah, man. Uh, if you would like, even with you or football edits, I'd I'd love to like. I'm I'm gonna start like interviewing people, not interviewing, but just kind of kicking it with people, like doing a little podcast, 
Um, I already have a guest. Well, not a guest, but someone that I want to uh, make a video with as well. If you'd like, I, I'd love to like maybe like do like a, I don't know, video chat and then we can like live stream it or something like that. And then, yeah, we can just chat and just talk. Um, I, 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 you, you seem like you, you're like, there's a lot that you, uh, there's, there's a lot that you know. And yeah, we can chop it up. Like I was even talking football edits as well. Like we can definitely chop it up, make like a football type of uh, meaningful edits. But in this, we can talk about something completely different. So if you if you'd like to, I'd definitely send you a DM, and then um, yeah, we can we can definitely do something. Uh, yeah, sounds good. I'll send I'll send you a DM. Uh, and yeah, football edits already we already have our contacts, so we can we're already planning something else as well. So um yeah okay cool 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 anyways and blow up right and it's like imagine if i just started six years ago and just posted like even once a month once a month six years ago how, how many videos is that like what 72 videos right so yeah now it's just like i'm gonna do it i'm gonna do it even if it's terrible videos um i gradually do want to up the content but then uh, it's that fine balance between posting even if it's terrible quality and like obsessing over detail, every detail, and then never posting, right? So, yeah. Uh, I realized I probably haven't. Where is it? Yeah, I haven't been even looking in the camera the entire time. It's all good. I'm recording this on my phone too, um, just because like you know I just need need to film at some point, right? So yeah. Um, I just felt like I went on like a long tangent. Yeah, I don't even remember what the point of this video is again. So yeah, uh, I guess to sum it up, I'm back on YouTube. Done procrastinating for six years. Yeah, uh, let's get it. Uh, hopefully I'll make some cool stuff on here. Like, I had all sorts of ideas, man. Like, I wanted to do pranks. I wanted to do, at some point, social experiments. That was in the early days. Then I wanted to do, like, um... You know those YouTubers that make, like, uh, really cool creations? Like, I think one of them is called The Hacksmith. I don't know. And then, like, Mark Robert type videos. You know, like, the, like, old cake. Oh, yo, uh, what's his name? Uh, Michael Reeves. Yeah. Michael Reeves type videos, those are legendary. Because, like, you make cool stuff. So that caters to my, like, nerdy geeky side. But then, like, toss in the comedy. And then make a really funny video. Uh, really funny. Really funny video. And then, okay. yeah. And then just throw that all together. I don't know, man. Uh, we'll see what kind of videos I make next. But yeah, I want to make something at some point. So yeah. Uh, if you guys have any ideas for videos, comment down below, I guess. Um, I'm not forgetting anything. So off the bat, I know you're. I know you're very creative. I can already tell that you're very creative. Um, what kind of ideas can uh? Let's see, uh, I'm gonna. I'll think about it right now and, okay, and maybe give some it. ideas. So I'm just gonna record a little bit right now, um, <laughs> and then mm. I'll toss it in the front, like in the intro, and then just clickbait people, right? Um, all right. I seen uh, what's his name? You think? This Muslim YouTuber, Way of Life SQ. He does this a lot. So like, he'll just film like a little clip at the or like at some point in his video, that's like outrageous and gets people all triggered, and then he'll just be like, uh, and then. He was toss that in the front, and then the video will be completely different. Um, so I'm gonna do that now. Um, all right. Where is it? Okay. All right. I got an idea. All right. Three, two, one. Okay. Yeah. You're using a DSLR to start your YouTube channel? Are you dead? <laughs> Get rid of your DSLR if you actually want to start a successful YouTube channel. Come on, guys. You guys should know better. That's literally what I thought the video was gonna be. <laughs> the camera industry is tricking you. I'm telling you for real. Throw away that DSLR like that. All right. Like, like Kobe, rest in peace. Uh, all right. Well, actually, he's left-handed, so maybe James Harden. Yeah, I won't but. put that in the front. Anyways. Uh, honestly, like, okay, I was gonna. I actually had an idea for this video, and I was gonna be like, um, why you don't need like I I must I'll, I'll still title it like this just because why not. Why you don't need a DSLR, um, or why you should throw away your DSLR to make uh, your first, U or to make a YouTube channel, right? Oh, I get distracted. I should like park facing a brick wall next time, so then I don't get distracted. All right, anyways, um, yeah, why you should throw away your 
DSLR to make a YouTube channel because like it's kind of related to the video because like I had a DSLR camera right I had three years with it I did nothing with it well I did but like I never actually put out content on YouTube with it right um because again like you get wrapped up in that whole cycle of oh it could be this much better or I could change that I could change uh that. just uh so I guess you shot a lot of photography right with the DSLR I'm assuming is that is that what uh what it is? You had it while while you had it, you were shooting um you were shooting uh, brain fog. Uh, you were shooting photography. I'm assuming, correct? Let me refilm that, and then just never get filmed. You know, so yeah. Um, on that note, um, I hope you guys didn't get too offended by the tits we had in front. Uh, yeah. Oh, let me just take like a thumbnail. I wanna. I wanna take like a quick like thumbnail. Like, Did I just hear that then? <laughs> Wait a minute. Thumbnail like. I wanna. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's funny. I like that. Like, YouTube thumbshot? And then I'm gonna just like Photoshop like a DSLR camera right there. Alright. There we go. Um, I'll grab a screen from the video or something. Jeez, this video is 13 minutes long. Alright. Uh, if you got through this, eh, if you got this far through the video, please subscribe, please drop a like, tell me what you want in the comments, um, drop a follow on the IG, all that's in the comments. description, man, I feel like a puppy, um, uh, man, I should even put, like, the bell sound, like, okay, I'll stop talking, alright, uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna make, okay, here's gonna be my outro. Okay, so you did get the thumbnail there. Ha! <laughs> We're all the way back. Back, 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 back. Alrighty, so I didn't, I, I didn't think I was gonna get through the whole video for some reason, but I ended up getting through the whole video. Like, it, it, before I even watched the video, I was like, okay, I'm gonna keep this nice and short, but I ended up, it ended up being way longer than I thought. Um, but yeah, bro, like, Great vid. Um, honestly, like you just have to put more out, more videos out there, and um, yeah, there's. I don't think there's even me. Like before I stream, like I, I, I sometimes I'm like, yo, like I don't want to stream. Like nobody's gonna watch my videos. Like who's gonna come into my stream, right? But sometimes you just have to do it and see what happens, right? Like I think I, I made a video previously. I just want to see my batteries out right now because I'm using my camera. Uh, it's kind of low, but it's all so it's all good. So I made a I mean actually you know what I'll 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 change my camera. Ah, you know what I'll just finish it up. Okay, so uh so I made a video about this because a week ago, like I said, I didn't even know how to use how to stream. Like I didn't know how to do all this stuff. Like I literally did not know how to do any of this stuff. I literally went to Best Buy, right? I ended up buying a, a streaming kit, right? I bought it, it had a webcam, it had a mic, it had a it had a, a capture card. I was like, you know what, let me try it out. I didn't like the way it was, right? And I spent like four bills on that, right? I went by Best Buy, I was like, I don't really like this. They're like, oh, I really said, I want to. I, I just want to return this, right? And I was like, if I can't return it, whatever, it is what it is, right? I did stream one time. So after that, I was like, you know what? I am going to... Uh, I, I am going to uh, brain fog. Let me remove this. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to return it, right? So I ended up going. I wanted to return it. And then after that, Best Buy is like, oh, why do you want to return it? I said, oh, I just don't like it. I should have just told I don't like it, right? Um, and then the lady's like, oh, you can't return it because it has a mic in it. I was like, okay. I was being really nice to her. I was like, you know what? That's fine. I understand if not. She was like, you know what? I'll talk to my manager. She talked to her manager. She's like, you know what? I'll make this exception. I'll let you do an exchange. So I got an exchange. I bought this, this little, this mic here. Uh, I ended up buying the capture card and I ended up buying something so my camera can connect to it. Last week, I didn't know how to, how to stream at all. I, I spent like 40 bucks to try stream, StreamYard. I didn't really like StreamYard. It didn't have that great quality compared to Streamlabs. Uh, I, you can even see this is how Streamlabs looks. I don't know if you stream at all, but I will show you how, how Streamlabs looks uh, right now. Uh, my bad. Just give me a second here. 
So this is how it looks, right? I'm this is how I'm running this this stream. So honestly, bro, my camera, okay, my camera's still alive. Honestly, bro, you just have to start and you just have to put stuff out there. Like I said, like I'm gonna DM you and we will like we can just chat or like chat it up. We can kick it, whatever, talk about whatever. Uh and then yeah, we can go from there and then just figure out um uh, yeah, some cool content. Uh, same I'm like in the same boat, you know, I'm always trying different things like I'm I, I wouldn't say I'm a, I'm a creative like I would say I'm more uh, OBS yeah, I, I, I've tried OBS um, Yeah, that's what I'm actually using. I'm using Streamlabs OBS um, So yeah, that's, that's what I'm that's what I'm currently using um, But yeah, it, I, I think you're I think you're, literally I didn't even know what OBS was a week ago, bro like <laughs> That's literally how it was for me. I and I, I, I but yeah, anyways um, Yeah clean um Mama, la, uh, yeah. Anything else that you want to look at, or uh, it's one thirty-seven. So I'll probably check out. I'll check out your football edits, and then from there, I'm not gonna check out the video football edits. But if you want, we can check out your IG. Uh, and then after that, if you want, we can do a little like stream where we check out your um your videos and you can have your chat and then we can talk about things that you may want to improve or racist memes anti-racism trump is racist oh <laughs> wow okay uh oh man i might get might get demonetized oh boy oh well uh let me change my my thing first here about the stream world uh let me just change my camera All right, so we are back. About a dip in twenty minutes. Got class. That's that's totally fine. I'm gonna I'm gonna leave too anyways. I have class as well, so I'm gonna hop off the stream after I watch this. Uh, so okay, so football edits. So uh, my YouTube channel is okay. So three subscribed people will get shout outs at the end of every video. I better get my shout out. <laughs> I hope I get my shout out. I hope I get my shout out. Okay, so okay, so you have that Pez. Okay, so, uh, so yeah, we've actually been we actually we actually been chatting a lot lately. So, if okay, so the first thing I have to say is use hashtags, right? Uh, hashtags are important. Um, I can okay. This is okay. So I would say hashtags. Uh, maybe I'll make like notes here for you so that you maybe you can check it out uh, on your on your spare time. Um. So let's make a notepad here, right? I uh, hope you can see it. Uh, if you can't, let me let me let me go on the word pad or whatever. Let me just make I'll I'll make a thing for you here, right? But yeah, Ismail, Ismail, yeah, for sure, a hundred percent. Like you just you just produce stuff, man. Like like I have to start posting IG again because like I could have broken that 400 uh, mark but i'm not posting anything so if it, it, it gets stale happy yeah happy is uh happy <laughs> uh the controversial app he yeah app is good um i have not used app in a while <laughs> but i should get back to them because uh app like they disappeared on us um okay so use hash Tags. Okay, so the first thing is use hashtags, right? Right, okay, so that's the first thing I would recommend for you to do here uh, Second thing is your bio, right? Uh, your bio is it, It's a uh, so let's see what your bio is. So my YouTube channel is so If I'm guessing you want to build a uh, uh, what, what is that was that didn't you make a video? Yeah, I did make a video on them. <laughs> I Did I did uh surprisingly no one else did i don't know how nobody else did videos on them people did previously made videos on them 
and then they just disappeared. I don't know if these people stopped using them. I don't know if they were like sponsored by them or something. Uh, I th I believe they're in like a third world country, which is why like their their communication was pretty off. Because uh, yeah, I was in a third world country earlier this year, and I, I know how it is. So so yeah, so your bio you may want to change the bio. Uh, just say like football videos or I, I, what are you trying to? What's your goal here? Are you trying to make Pez videos? Are you trying to make Liverpool videos or YouTube? Yeah, I would say on your bio, just tell people that um, uh, uh, tell people that uh, just tell me what you're trying to do on your on your bio, right? Just be like, uh, I make football videos. Uh, big Liverpool fan. That's what you could do if you want, right? Uh, yeah, I I would say that you can you can do something like that. Uh, what's your highlights here? Michelle Naldo. Yeah, so your 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 content is created around football. Uh, yes. Yeah, so it's around around football. How good is Liverpool? Can I can I go here? Okay. We have to use have to use the app. Uh, who won the twenty two twenty two World Cup? Uh, Senegal. Uh, but yeah, I would say that uh, football edits. Those pictures are when I was. Younger. Uh, those pictures when I was younger. Oh, okay, I see. Oh, so you just have to. Oh, so you just have to post, man. Also, switch your business account. Yeah, 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 exactly. Put the link to your your YouTube channel. Uh, I'm gonna use uh, I'm gonna use Ismail's page because I think he's a good example. Uh, I thought I was following you. Yeah, I'm following you. So yeah, it's something like this. This is very nice, clean. Um, obviously, have your link. You don't have to have Linktree if you don't want because you're, you're mainly focused on YouTube. Uh, but yeah, I would have Linktree. Have, or sorry, have your link there. Right, maybe like football. I make football videos or football channel or whatever it is, right? Go there and then, yeah. And it's, this, you can do all this stuff through your phone. So I'm going to write this down for you here. Uh, bio, hashtags, bio um add link right what up add link to your your channel i guess uh and also make business account so you want to make it into a business account right if you need help with that you can always just let me know i, I can help you with that um yeah what else yeah you, honestly you, you uh what is it again? Rax. Also, the name too. Uh, the name is football edits taken. Is that why you don't have the name? Uh, I mean, it's a big name, right? So of course, obviously, it might be taken. Football edits. Yeah. Maybe have the name a little more catered towards football or something related to football. Uh, the reason why I say that Rax Oscar Five. The name is a little confusing. Uh. A little bit so if you want obviously you don't obviously don't have to but maybe you'll want to like name change like these are just ideas you don't always hey what's up sandile what's up sandile what's happening bro what's happening hold on i'm sorry i have to i have to give him a shout out uh what's your ins ig again sandile oh there you go dilla scope uh, you're in Mississauga, right? You, you guys should connect. You guys, you guys should connect. Ismail and, uh, and, and Diloscope. You guys should connect. Okay, but anyways, uh, but yeah, football edits. Um, so yeah, you guys, you guys should definitely connect. Oh, okay. Oh my god, okay. Uh, I, I'll, I'll review your channel as well. Uh, sorry, your 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 IG as well. Uh, yeah, you should you guys should all connect. Anyways, uh, so yeah, I will definitely review it. I'll 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 do yeah I'll do a quick review on yours too, man. So okay, use hashtags, bio, add a link to your channel, make business account. Um, racks. Uh, yeah. Okay, cool. So let's get back to this one here. So three subscribe people will get shout outs. So obviously you just want to uh. Yo, football edits. 
um you 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 have my contact information let's just like chat it up and let's talk about this uh i feel like just making a video on this it may be a little hard uh but we can definitely talk and like even we can even dedicate a stream to your to your uh what you have right um yeah we can definitely we can definitely dedicate a stream to you if you want like we can do that and then we can kind of like go through it and then i will just let you know everything to like i'll give you the step by steps for your account and then you can kind of go through it and then you can just like we can figure out what to do right uh but these are things i would say that you can do and the last thing post post right you want to post stuff man like if you want you can start posting like photos of like different games uh you can post um making a video revamp uh of revamping his ig yeah exactly i think that's a good idea right let's 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 actually do that let's let's make it happen uh I, I yeah let's do it uh i'll i'll i'll, I'll contact you and then we'll, i'll let you know what we can do right so yeah so let's do that let's 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 uh schedule a time and then we can make uh we can kind of like look into your account and then after that we can um yeah we can review everything and we can we can definitely do that right sounds good Yeah, let's go. Okay, so let's go. Let's go you. Let's go Sans. It's been a while. Dude, I, I've been on a detox, so I haven't been checking out IG. All right, so let's see. Let's see you. Let's see what let's see what my friend Sans has here. Why can't I check out his story? It's weird. Normally I can, but oh, I see. There's no there's no story. This so I'll check later. Um, okay. So Sans, you already know what I'm gonna tell you, bro. <laughs> you already know. You already know. You already. You already. You already know what I'm gonna say here, bro. Where's the content? Bro, where is the content? We need. We need the content. You're leaving us dry here. <laughs> <laughs> you're leaving us hanging we need content um yeah otherwise bro your, your thing is clean uh still manifesting <laughs> still manifesting um okay so i haven't checked out any ig so I, maybe you've posted re uh like some you post a lot of stories though, i know that when it last day 25 starts now happy belated the quarter life crisis is coming to an end i turned 25 uh, about two months ago actually uh fall something said i like this stuff bro like th your stories like your stories are on point what are some practical ways you remain consistent um honestly i uh i i, I think it's just scheduling it uh something that i do i like to get i like to schedule posts um there's a good app called app he as uh, ismail was saying as well uh yeah your content's amazing like your content is great like you have great content bro like i i can't even like say anything about content um uh yeah 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 uh, i appreciate it so yeah honestly uh what was i saying i i lost my train of thought um yeah you just have to uh yeah create content your stories are amazing though like 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 your stories there's i i i, I don't know if anyone's commenting on that but your story is it's like a it's like an actual story like as cliche as that may sound hey i see you're rocking the do-rag now hey eh? i got my do-rag too actually i got i i sleep with the do-rag just to make sure my hair doesn't uh oh wait what did you get a new camera bro is that is that the tamron we were literally just wait is your lens cap on <laughs> something tells I still cradle the camera like newborn cheeks. Uh, uh, the luxury of wearing glasses and taking photos. Interesting, interesting. Okay. Yeah, your stories, bro, are, are, are clean. They're... Oh, sorry. It might be a little too loud. My bad, guys. Keeping the hair moist. <laughs> yeah, exactly. 
Black Lives Matter, of course. Of course, of course. Yeah, your 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 thing is you you're solid, especially with your stories, man. This is good. This I like the blackout actually. Blackout's really cool. Uh, okay. Well, this one was really cool. Sounds cool too. Hey, there's one picture I saw that you posted that was really good. I think it was like a full image. This one. Someone. I like this one. Yeah. Yeah, bro. I mean, uh, yeah. It's just it's post. <laughs> Literally. Um, obviously, life comes in a way. Like, it's not like you're just like sitting down and you're like, oh, I should post. Like. No, you're you're probably doing stuff. You got stuff to do. You have a life. Um, oh, it's any filter. You have a life, right? Like you, you obviously. Oh, oh, oh! I didn't know this. See, you got you got your website there, Amazon Ads. Oh wait, okay, so it's still it's still in development. Okay, that's good. Uh, LinkedIn. You probably have a clean LinkedIn profile. We know you, we know you, you're, you're nice, clean. Oh, I like that. That's nice. That's beautiful. Uh, Hackneys. And you were making YouTube videos for at, at some point too, right? You were making videos. Uh, what was it again? Was it San Sanita? There you go. You were making videos. You, 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 you were making videos. This is a test. Yeah, no, you you were making videos at some point. I remember this. I remember this, my my G. <laughs> What's up, everybody? What's happening? My name is Sandy Nemakajela. I am an integrated video design specialist. Something, something. I've been trying to figure out what the f is going on over here. By the way, uh, yeah. Ismail. If you want to chat with uh, Sandile about the cameras, we were just talking about that earlier, about uh, whether he should get Sony or he should get a... Uh, uh, yeah. Journey. I'm still on... So this is my first attempt at recording a YouTube intro. I don't know where this is going to go. I don't know whether or not this is going to be a success. But a lot of people in my circle have started something during this COVID time. So this is my attempt at starting something I've always always wanted to. I've always wanted to start. Like yeah. So it's I'll also link up uh, Ismail's video. I think he might have left. I think he he might have uh gone to uh get school or something. But I'll link his I'll link his video so you can check it out. He'll uh or I'll send a it a lot of jump cuts. Expect a lot of Okay cool. See so you guys good. And uh yeah this is this is a test this is literally just a test yeah um this is it this is it i'm also so that's that's it have a good day <laughs> all right okay. all right so i'll link up that his, his video as well so this is his video here right uh how do i do that on this uh, how do I do that? How do I do that? How do I do that? Oh my days! Your IG is fired too. Yeah, his IG is fire, man. Like he wanted, we were looking at his IG. His IG is clean. Uh, this is a video. Not as crazy as yours. Hey, y'all, y'all, y'all are too humble here. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, it smells is clean too. Yeah, yeah. All right, so uh, okay, before I hop off, uh, what what a, what what's your goal with this with this sense? We were talking about that with the smile. What's your goal? Like, what are you trying to do? Like, I I I I'll I'll just kind of go through me first. So me, um, I look up to like I'm I haven't been on IG in a while, but ideally I'd like for it to be like kind of like a guy called Alex Costa. Uh, I'll just show you. 
I'm trying to get into like men's fashion, uh, fitness. I'm going, I'm studying to become a personal trainer, uh, but I'd also groom men's grooming as well. So that's kind of what I'm leaning towards. So I, ideally I want that to be like that. Right. And then also, I was also talking to Ismail as well, but, uh, what are you, what are you looking, what are you looking to do? We actually have a video together too. I don't know if you remember this, but you just let me know. Uh, before before I hop off the stream, I kind of want to talk about that, and then I will hop off since I I do have to study, and I I I, I uh. Okay, so I'm gonna pull up that video as well while we wait. I want to know like what's your goal like what are you trying to do what's your goal with youtube or not youtube but like just in general because I, I find that like a lot of times with what was like as content creators whatever we are uh scaling to 10k consistently posting what is consistently posting to you for me consistently posting is like maybe once a week but that's just that's just me or like twice a week Generating quality content uh, around human interaction. Okay. Got some tips about for skin the IG at least. I don't know about YouTube. Sh sounds good, man. Uh, let's talk about it when we when we make vi when we do the I don't know stream or whatever together. Uh, even you, Sandy, like, I'd love to get you on on a video one of these days. Um, kind of like when we're going through like a live stream or a video, and we just chat it up. We kind of like just just kind of go through um. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, make a video on it. Hundred percent, make a video on it. Um, yeah, I'd love to get your perspective on that too. I, I, I'm also in the same boat. Like we're like we're all like in this same boat. We're trying to figure this out. So that's why uh, I kind of want to just make like a, a little. That's why I kind of wanted to do the stream because I have work to do on my account. Like we all have work to do. So I think that we can all help each other out here and. Uh, so Sandile is a visual creator. He is also a director as well also leaning towards photos and he's very into that media space. We went to school together in the past and we developed a very good friendship. So I wanted to showcase a little bit of our, you know, our little meetup together. I'm still trying to figure out my camera, but I did realize my manual focus is probably better when I'm filming someone. So that is something that Dude, I- Dude, I was shooting my Nikon D3100. It was terrible. <laughs> it was terrible. I didn't like it. Oh God! Hey, look at that. Peace, guys. What's good? The homie, the homie, the homie, the homie. <laughs> hey, man. I don't think that's the. Look at this boy. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Um, I'll send you a DM as well. I, I think I, I still have your number. But <laughs> I'll send you a DM. It's fine. Mid flat exposed. D Rock. Oh, cringe. What's good, guys? How you guys all doing? We're out here vlogging. Keep going, keep going. Making those moves. <laughs> Making it happen. Look at this. Look at this. City, guys. Can't even look see this. my look face. This, look at that. <laughs> Beautiful. So I'm out here Dude, my, my manual hands. focus, like, my manual focus is terrible here. Like, you can't even see, like, ugh, it's terrible. Oh, wow. We used to go to the same school together back at uh, VCC. You, you spread some wisdom here, which is why I wanted to share this. I was actually going to yeah, send uh, this to you, but... Catch you on another side. Look at this. Your goal is to become a creative director? Photography. Like yeah. Creative direction. Yeah. yeah. It's this... I don't know. I think with an art form, you have a certain dominion over what you create. So, like, as... General content creator, you have your camera, you have your laptop, you have your bedroom. You're there, you're creating. But then the higher you climb, sounds good, man. Yeah, let's let's do that. You to make a beautiful story or content or whatever. So I don't know. I think creative direction at a higher level is my calling because, like, some of the things and paradigms that I want to shift 
with the stories I tell, man, it's at that level where I can't do it alone, where I can't just do it with this camera. You know, we are who we are with others and because of others. So I wish I could do a bad trip right now. All right, yeah. So, anyways, I'm gonna hop off the stream, guys. Uh, thanks for joining the stream. Uh, I'm gonna reach out to all of you guys. So, let's make something happen. Today's Wednesday, so I might stream maybe tomorrow, maybe not. We'll see what happens in class tonight. Um, yeah, I appreciate you guys all joining. And again, if there's any Thing that you guys want to see or if you guys want to like chat it up whatever just let me know we can definitely do something and yeah i will talk to you guys in the next uh i guess next stream or video whatever it is so don't forget to stay authentic